Eo TV, your number one gospel entertainment channel. If you're just tuning in, please endeavor to subscribe, like, comment, and share this video. Every first service of the month is designed as Thanksgiving Sunday in most churches, especially Pentecostal churches in Nigeria. It is usually a Sunday where we thank God for shielding us throughout the last month and anticipating that His grace will cover us for the next month. The Redeemed Christian Church of God pastors across the nation are expected to connect their parishes with the national headquarters where Pastor E.E. Deboye usually delivers his sermon. Something happened at this last Thanksgiving Sunday that resulted in Pastor Deboye's last son and personal assistant, Leke, calling the church pastors goats. Subscribe as I bring you the full gist shortly. Good news, good news, good news. Are you a gospel skit maker, content creator, or movie producer looking for an avenue to showcase your content? AOL TV is here for you. So go ahead and bring your content and have us showcase them on our YouTube channel every day. Send an email to helloaoltv at gmail.com. So what are you waiting for? Send your content and have them stream live on AOL TV. So the usual Thanksgiving service was going on fine. As it is a norm in RCCJ that the Geo sermon is expected to be the only sermon for that Sunday as all pastors are expected to connect to the national headquarters where the general overseer would deliver his sermon. Some pastors were said to have delivered their own messages, which seemed to have provoked Leke, Pastor Deboe's last son and personal assistant. He took to Instagram and made a post and I quote, why would you preach another sermon after Daddy Jehu has finished preaching? You are not a son. You are a goat, sir. Next Thanksgiving service. Just do an altar call, then Thanksgiving. Although the post was taken down, Lake's comments seem to have generated heated reactions on social media. Reacting on Instagram, one Ikenna Odogu said, it's becoming more obvious what these churches are all about. Another user named Akidere said, I wonder at times if he's truly a biological son of Daddy Gio. He is so vulgar. An enraged user who claimed to be a member of the church also disapproved of Lake's value. He said, and I quote, I am a redeemer, but because your father is a pastor doesn't give you the anointing to be one. Why would you call ordained ministers that preached after that the Jew had preached goats? Is that what Jesus preached? That's why you pioneer things like the RCCG Directorate of Politics, Business Sunday programs, and some leadership courses. You're nothing more than a selfish politician in disguise. Imagine reading prayers from a book, says one of his followers. Another user, Joy Fulpeck, said, and I quote, as a member of RCCG, I have to say you keep embarrassing the church. My older brother that attends another ministry was a person that drew my attention to your ill-advised social media cloud chasing post. Nigerians have since condemned the comments made by the last son and senior personal assistant to the general overseer of the redeemed Christian Church of God, Pastor E.A. Deboe. What's your take on it? Let's hear you out in the comments section. We have exclusive videos in our video session. Do well to check them out. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and also share with family and friends. Turn on the post notification bell so that anytime we drop any new video, you will get notified first. Until next time, don't forget that Jesus loves you. Go and remain blessed. <laughs>